Dougal say what was wrong with Douglas? No, just to get here as soon as we could. Oh, dear, I hope he's not too bad. Well, I'm sure he's in good hands. Hey, it's the boys! So what you're saying is, he thinks he's some kind of Australian hunter? Aye, that's a way to buy if it's that way. He doesn't think he's Scott anymore. Oh, I can see. Porridge untouched. His pipes are cold. Aye, and he's not even touched the shortbreads. Oh, dear. Where is he now? Up back. The outback? He's gone to Australia. He ain't near the outback. He's outback. Oh, he's out the back. <sighs> He's fast asleep. But it's the middle of the day. And didn't he understand? I know what it is. He's on Australian time. So it is, I. Probably just a phase he's going through. I wouldn't worry about it. He's not doing anybody any harm. Ah, uh, you'll see, you'll see. Uh... Why is it always me who has to sleep on the floor? Cos I've got a bad back. Well, so have I. Well, you should think self lucky. Laying on a hard floor is good for a bad back. Why don't you lay on the floor, then? Cos your back's more important to me than my own. You're so kind. Thank you. Wonder if Douglas is going to be all right. Yes. It'll be as right as rain. You'll see. Good night. Was that you? Sorry. Must have been the smoked raspberries. Did you have them as well? Sounds like one of those Rolf Harris things. That's no paintbrush. It's worse than I thought. We're going to have to do something. Is there any way special that we could take Douglas that would remind him that he's really Scottish? I lock the door. I haven't got the key. Not lock the door. Lock the door. Ah, lock the door castle. Ancestral home of the Chuckles. Aye, that's that, aye. Apparently, it's a ruin. But any Chuckle can still go there and ask for help from the ghost of the first laird if they ever get in trouble. Nickety nackety do the new, aye, aye. Aye, well, if the ghost of the first laird can't help us, Douglas is really in trouble. Can I have a look at the book, please? Of course you can. <gasps> Careful, it's very heavy. <laughs> Whose stupid idea was this, anyway? Yours. And I thought it was a good idea. Ah, yes, it was. But I thought it had been awake by now. Oh, sorry, Douglas. Are you sure this is the right way, Dougal? Aye, north-east. North-east? I didn't hear. Uh, well, I think we should go this way. Here? Yes, but if we go down that way... I we... know this place like the back of my hand. What's up? He only wants to go that way. Well, he knows the place better than you do. Yes, but I said... You carry we... on, Dougal. Come on. What now? Oh, oh, I've twisted my ankle. I went over on that rock. Oh, dear. Uh... I don't think I can walk. Well, try. Oh, oh no, 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 no. It's no good. Oh. What are we going to do? We're miles from anywhere. I have no idea. It's a pity there's only room for Douglas on that. Oh. Do you know, I never thought of that. Well, he might wake up soon, eh? <laughs> Doesn't look like it. What's up? It's Paul. He's twisted his ankle. Crocodiles. Hey, hey, crocs! Hey, hey, hey! <laughs> hey, hey, where, where, where? It's all right. Douglas says I can have it. Uzzah! Hey, there me! He's trying to become free. Oh, cover. no. <laughs> what now? Hey, 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 hey. Give me a quarter, Skippy. What is it? Highland Brook? Oh! Put not your fingers in my stew, or it'll be the end of you. It's okay. I'm not hungry anyway. I am. I know who you are. 
You are he that seeks the Laird of Chuck, the answers to your woes. Go westward till you meet the mist, but quickly on your toes. Don't suppose you've got a French fancy I could have? French fancies have a none to give, but warnings have a two. Touch not the staff of Cannibore. It will be the worst for you. How about a potato cake? Forget about his need for food and answer this request. We seek the lead, as you say, so tell us which way's best. That way. I don't know who he was, but at least he told us which way to go. I suggest we do as he said. You're right. Come on. You know, I'm really starving. Must be all this fresh air. Hey, fish out your water and the barbie hi-ho! He's got a barbie on the go. Hey? Well, that's not Scottish. Oi! Hey, nope. Got it. Come here. Come here to me. Come here to me. you got in there? Have a look. Oh. Oh, very nice. Is that from the Highlands? It's gonna have to go. What's this? Some real honest Scottish food. I don't suppose you fancy climbing down for those stakes. What with my ankle? Hey, watch. Only a joke, you can. My pipes are no joke. Now stop it, you two. We're here to help poor Douglas. Aye, aye, aye. At least we're nice and warm here by the fire. What's the matter? You, you having a nightmare or something? It must be leaking. Oh, dear. I'll tell you what, I'll change places with you if you like. Will you? I don't want to see you get damp, do I? That's very kind. Yes, come on then, slop over. OK. Hey, steady, steady. Oh, careful. Oh, steady, oh, steady. Oh, careful, steady. Oh, that's it. Uh, thank you. Uh, it's no, no problem. Good night, then. Good night. Believe it. It's only a joke, you Ken. My name's not Ken. Hang on. Where's Douglas? Oh, 
Hear the news? He's here. Look, that must be the staff of Cannibal the old crone was telling us about. Aye, it is, it is, aye. Douglas, be careful. You don't know what it might do. What are we going to do now? I see my warnings you ignored and touched the cursed staff. He didn't really mean to. He did it for a laugh. Where he's gone, it is not nice. He will not find it funny. I don't suppose you've got with you a piece of bread and honey. Excuse him. He's always thinking of his tummy. Well, that's understandable. There's quite a lot of it to think about. What can we do? Diet. I mean about Douglas. Oh! Just wait here and count till ten, for he'll return quite quick. But next time, please do what you're told. Or are you lot just thuck? We should stop doing that. Where's Douglas gone, the new? Yes, where has Douglas gone? <laughs> Wherever he went, it worked. He's Scottish again. Yeah. Thank goodness for that. Let's go home. Da, 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 da. Seems a pity to have come all this way without seeing the ancestral home of the Chuckles. And I, for one, had love to see the ghost of the lead. Well, we for three wouldn't. Come on, can't be far. <sighs> this must be it. We're here. The mysterious mists of Macintosh. Find me toe. Sorry. Was that your head? No, it wasn't my head. Aye! Oh, sorry, Dougal. Does Miss Dewsley smell of wood smoke? Good eye, sports. Fancy a snake. It's me, Duncan, first laird of Chuckle. I've dropped the name now. Got a bit fed up of all that Scottish stuff. Call me Bruce. Brisbane Bruce, the Aussie recluse. But why? Well, it's all a bit strange, really. I was it, hunting the haggis. When suddenly, from out of the sky, fell this barbie. Then some Aussie steaks and a surfboard. Can you explain that? No. Me neither. Tell you what, park your bums. I'll throw a couple of kanga steaks on the barbie and we can discuss it. Tiny kangaroo down, sports. Tiny kangaroo down, all together now. Tiny kangaroo down, sports. Tiny kangaroo down, all together now. Tiny kangaroo down, sports. Tiny kangaroo down. Tiny kangaroo down. What's my day, haven't I? Have a nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> you! We are here! <laughs> <laughs> 